so this is just a quick um a quick review of uh, a link uh, one of uh, my subscribers sent to me about this magnetic 220 volt jet inverter in lagos right uh it's um it's on gg it's on gg now and i was just scanning through the the stuff looks like uh, the video they sent to me the fk tech made as well and um I couldn't help but notice some things. I mean, if this was made in China, right? Why is it so scratched? Look at everywhere here, everywhere on my, on this left hand side, it looks so scratched. Like uh, it's not made in a factory. It doesn't look like uh, it's a China product. Um, it's just a rough, you know, glass. I'm just. I'm just kind of looking at it roughly and this one is even saying 13.2 volt maybe the voltage is going up and down by itself because the one on uh, FK Tech was less than 12 volt right and um, you know all of this uh, my first uh, the first thing I noticed the first thing I noticed, you know, just at a glance, I'm still going to do an extensive look at it. If you, if you, if you look at this close shot again, look at where this um, LED display is. It, it looks like a rough cut. It doesn't cut with precision, you know. Not cut with precision. Look at the surroundings here. It's not cut with precision. I mean, China will not make something like this. This looks like Nigerian. That's where I'm going. <laughs> looks like it's made in Nigeria. Look at the printing on itself. It's a sticker. I mean, China doesn't need to put a sticker on, on, on their products as a label. They can just print on it directly. Why would they need to? Well, of course, one of the things is that you don't want a counterfeit product in town. So... You know that anybody could print it a, a sticker and paste it there. This 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 doesn't look uh, China. This doesn't look China. This doesn't look China. I'm still going to do an extensive review on this. Now, another thing I noticed is um look at this. Look at this seller, this merchant, whoever that is selling this, they said is in Ikoyi Lagos, right? and they said uh, the the inverter has 5.1 volt 12 volt 24 volt and 220 volt so if you have 220 volts why do you need to plug it to another inverter again that aspect beats my imagination i, I don't know what to think of it now emeka njoku registered this account just two days ago are you seeing something and it was last seen 16 hours ago this was just two days ago two days ago so i want to point out something to you guys i'll quickly i'll quickly go to to youtube channel now and see when um fk tech posted this video about the same product let's just see hmm? Okay, so this is a video about uh, about the <laughs> about the magnetic jet inverter stuff. And guys, what can you see? What can you see right here? Said two days ago. So they are the exact time. I mean, this guy is a genius. Um, this guy is a fucking genius like i salute him i have to clap for him at this point the master plan is actually to sell this product but you come on your video saying that you don't ask anybody to come so you are using online <laughs> online means to actually sell the product whether it works or not i don't know if it works of course guys may buy it but if you are the one buying it please Tell us if it works for you according to how it was described, or it's just a way of ripping you off your money. He said you bought it 62,000 or so on Amazon, 
I was on Amazon. I didn't see any for any damn thing like that. I mean, you know, Amazon is different. What they do is they warehouse all the product they want to sell. They don't ask you to to send to the seller. I mean, to the buyer by yourself. Amazon warehouse all the product they want to sell, just like Walmart and only eBay. eBay. You know, it's like GG. eBay is like GG. Um, they only connect you to buyers. You and the buyer now have your. The only difference with eBay is that eBay has security. They, they process payment and all of that. And if you are not yet, you know, um, you have money back guarantee and all of that. But but this guy went on GG. You know, he went on GG whereby it's just you and the seller. Whoever is just you and the seller. If you are ripped off, that's fine. Now, of course, I've lost money on Gigi, and uh, you know I'm taking more mails. Nobody will find that money for you, you know. So, uh, it was going on Gigi. That's one of the red flags. So, if you are putting your money on this, be sure you are getting the product, and the product is actually working, you know. I'm still going to do an extensive, extensive um, stuff on this, you know and you know dates dates will change according to the days i make the video but i just got a message someone asking me to look into this right now ken day from ife is asking me to look into it and that's why i'm quickly just a rough um a rough something you know so he said he bought it on amazon the product is not on amazon and the link he showed at the end of that video leads to conga now we are seeing the product on GG. Well, uh, I may not be so correct though, because of course you have liberty to sell your product anywhere. But this product just got on GG the same day the the video got online, <laughs> and he said it might be his last video because the real money will be coming from the product now, and the product is listed for how many? How much? Let me go and check, please. Uh, 97,000. Wow, that's a lot. That's a lot. I would have bought this if it was still around that range of 60, 62,000. But I don't want to lose 100k to this nonsense, really. So I will, I will wait for you guys <laughs> to buy it first. Then we can do the review together. Or just send me your own review and tell me. Oh, it works fine. Oh, it doesn't work fine and all of that. Before I I do my own final review. Before I do my own final review. Yeah, this is just things I quickly documented. I quickly want to document so I, I don't forget. Um, I'll look into it and uh, try to see the possibility of it, of, of it working. So, take care guys. This account was registered two days ago and the video also dropped two days ago best of luck to you guys